In this video we are going to learn How to kiss more passionately and romantically There are kisses for just about every emotion and occasion, but on those certain occasions when you want to communicate desire and maybe lust, not just any kiss will do, you need a fiercely passionate kiss. To kiss passionately, set a romantic mood and start with a series of slow, closed mouth kisses before gradually varying the openness and speed of your continued smooching, and heighten the intensity of the kiss by moving your hands along your partner's body and planting a few kisses along the neck or elsewhere. When performed with skill and feeling, there is no greater expression of desire than a passionate kiss. Make sure your breath is minty fresh and clean. Naturally you practice good oral hygiene, but if you have any doubts about your breath, take a breath mint shortly before the kiss. Make sure to finish the mint or gum before you lock lips. Approach the kiss with confidence. Try to kiss their cheeks so they turn their head your way. Once you've chosen the right moment to kiss someone, there's no turning back, especially if it's your first time kissing that particular person. Be decisive and confident. If the person doesn't want the kiss, he or she will let you know, but until then, act as though you're a pro. Set the mood. If you truly want your kiss to be passionate, you will need to set the right mood. That doesn't mean that you have to throw rose petals everywhere and light a hundred candles, but you should be someplace without many distractions that way you can both focus on each other, and your passionate kiss. Lean in and tilt your head slightly. Leaning in signals that you want to kiss the person, and tilting your head prevents you crushing your nose against the other person's. Start slowly. Don't try to thrust your tongue into your partner's mouth right away. Simply press your lips against theirs. Close your eyes as you do to heighten the intimacy and to avoid looking at the pores on your partner's nose. Imagine your eyes are being controlled by a dimmer switch. Let yourself linger between kisses. Kiss your partner once, slowly, letting it last for a few seconds. Then slowly draw your lips away, keeping them close enough to your partner's lips so that they are almost touching, but aren't. This lingering will help build the passion, and will really capture your partner's full attention. Open your lips slightly. Once the kiss is accepted, try opening your lips slightly. If the other person follows suit, try slightly varying the openness of your lips, both more and less open, throughout the kiss. You may wish to explore the person's lips and tongue a bit with the tip of your tongue. There are no rules, just try to make your motions smooth. Consider the French kiss. As the kiss progresses, you may want to try French kissing, in which you insert your tongue lightly into your partner's mouth and let it dance with your partner's tongue. Be sensually aggressive. After you've been kissing for a while, you should try getting a little more adventurous. In between kisses, gently bite your partner's lower lip, letting your teeth graze their lip as you pull away. Try some necking. If things are going well, consider spicing it up a bit by moving your head down to kiss and lightly nibble your partner's neck. Keep your arms busy. You seldom, maybe never see a great kiss in which the participants just let their arms dangle at their sides. At the very least, embrace your partner and gently pull him or her towards you. You can also run your hands through your partner's hair, or caress his or her back, sides, or other parts of the body. Wrapping your arms around your partner can also be a big turn on. Try a 10 second kiss. Some find that a kiss of at least 10 seconds in duration will passionately bond two people more than a shorter kiss. Just hold the kiss for longer, regulating your breathing and keeping your eyes closed. Do not let yourself be distracted by anything. Whether it's fireworks going off behind you or people walking by you at the airport you should not let yourself become distracted. If you look around while kissing, your partner is probably going to feel a little rejected and the passion-o-meter will definitely drop. <laughs>